Students in the Macklin Business Institute are launching a global e-waste awareness and action project. Most Americans are probably not aware of the electronic waste or e-waste epidemic, nor are they aware they are contributing to it. The goal of the project is to raise awareness about the electronic waste scams that are going around in the world we live in today. The electronics that should have been recycled properly are actually being shipped to the third world countries and they're actually polluting the environment that these third world countries are inhabiting. When computers, monitors, and other electronic components are improperly disposed of, materials can seep into the groundwater and be toxic enough to cause serious health risks. The result is contamination of water resources for humans and grazing animals, indirectly contaminating food sources. In an effort to avoid high cost of proper disposal, e-waste is often shipped overseas for processing in developing nations like Africa, China, and India. According to the EPA, roughly 14% of all e-waste was recycled properly in 2007. Over 80% of it ended up in our landfills. Everyone has something old or unused lying around the home or office, like maybe something needs to be cool before Christmas. On common types of uh, electronics, um, students and faculty can drop off at our various locations include um, cell phone, phone chargers, uh, printers, um, battery chargers, Instead of throwing it in the trash, sending it down to the landfill, what we need them to do is bring it down to the campus. We're going to have multiple locations, actually. Maybe, um, we'll have a place in the Humanities Building, library, down by the cafeteria. So we definitely need students to bring those items down to there. We're going to have collection boxes. It's going to have a big sign. It's going to tell them what they need to do in order to put it in the box, and that's what we need students to do. Look for the special e-waste disposal boxes around campus.